Hello, about hollow ring we have two different options. The first one, when it's a plain band like this one, you can use the hollow ring that we have here. So you have all the settings. Let me go just with uh, this one. All right, so from here you can select where to start to do the transition. All right, so you can do it like this. So you can play with that from the first screen. You can go also, if you want something uh, asymmetrical, you can click on the mirror limits. All right. And then on the second tab, you can just set what thickness do you want to apply. As you can see, it's doing the operation between the top surface and the cutter. Also, you can select, because let me just hide uh, this. So you can see it from here. You what you can do is select what thickness you want, All right? So if you want to create the thickness, you can create it from here. So you do this shape, All right? So this is one option that you have that will be parametric because if I show that and then I do the uh, volume difference. you get the hollow ring but this as I said is for is mostly on mainly for bands like this one but if what you want to do is just uh, a hollow ring uh, following different shapes then I will advise go for the let me just delete this one uh, I will also show this hollow ring and hollow show the profile placer so I delete this and just say that you have a ring that it's bigger from the top so if you want to make this hollow my advice is do it like this so you keep this here and then you go to the profile placer and you do any kind of hollow that you want so we do that so you have more freedom to do anything that you want you need to use the reference uh, as a reference the, the grid so this is something that we will keep working because I know that sometimes customers would like to say okay I want this thickness here but there is also other customers that they want it like this they want we want this thickness here and we want it uh, with this thickness uh, on the side so with the profile placer you have the option to do anything that you want all right so now if i want to go more like this and because you, it's parametric you can just measure what distance you have and you, if you need to play with it again you can do it very easily all right so this is my advice because then the shape that you get is very nice so if I validate and I go to like this the perspective shape the hollows that you get are very very smooth and very nice so I believe that this is one of the best options that that we have all right so I hope this replies your uh, your questions hope it helps thank you